Hey guys, this is Echo Sowers, and you're checking out a serum tip and trick tutorial video on ADSR. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can lock an effect chain and audition it on different sounds. So here's the sound that I have loaded up right now. Now the reason I chose this is it has quite a bit of effects has a second filter, has a bunch going on. So what I'm gonna do is I wanna hear how this sounds. So let's copy this preset on a clean bass. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to, uh, we're just gonna copy this right now. So let's say I wanted to find like a clean bass sound that I wanted to quickly dirty up. Let's load up this bass. All right, so back win is cool. So I'm gonna go to paste again. So I'm back at that dirty bass. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to menu and go to lock effect rack. Okay, now I'm gonna go back to that patch and we're gonna to go to back when here and you'll see that the effects stayed the exact same. And now that sound, which was a lot cleaner a second ago, is really dirty. This is a really cool thing you can do. You can kind of audition it's kind of fun to go find like a really nasty trap sound and try it on like a pluck for instance so we'll try that with this we had a really gross bass sound let's go load up a pluck and again you want to make sure that you have the low or lock effect rack active so let's go load up a pluck we'll let's load up a random pluck here notice the effects won't change but the preset has changed All right, just so, just for comparison's sake, let's see what this Pluck Dynasty actually sounds like. So I'm gonna go turn off the lock effect rack. Here's what it is with the effect rack. Let's turn that off. And then let's actually load that preset. And here's the difference. And then we'll paste that preset because I copied it. Right, so you can do some crazy stuff by just locking effect chains and then seeing how they sound on different presets. So I wanted to share this with you guys in case you didn't know about the feature. It can be kind of cool. I've used it when I've had like a session or ran into some type of mental block where I couldn't come up with something cool and fresh. Sometimes this can get you over that hump. If you have any questions or comments, let me know below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Like I said in the beginning of the video, I'm Echo Soundworks. Thank you so much for watching guys. I will see you next time.